So, back to school. The season is finally upon us. And whether you're excited or excruciated to head back, let's get you styling something a little more exciting than just a plain t-shirt and jeans. So, for those of you feeling down in the dumps, here are 15 back to school outfits to make you hate this time a little less and make you excited to get back to campus that much more. I also want to thank Urban Outfitters for sponsoring this video. Honestly, the collab of my dreams. I love Urban Outfitters so much. So all of these outfits are gonna be incorporating a couple pieces from the Urban Outfitters site. I'm gonna have all the pieces linked down below in the description box. Right now on the Urban Outfitters site, there's a ton of back to school collections, including a bunch of clothing like what you guys will see here. And there's also a bunch of home stuff too. So if you're heading off to college, wanna decorate your dorm room, you guys know I'm all about the aesthetic. There's a bunch of really cute pieces on there that you guys should definitely check out. So go ahead, click the link down below in the description, check out Urban Outfitters. And without further ado, let's get into the outfits. So getting right into the first look, I am gonna go ahead and do my variation of a t-shirt and jeans, but jazz it up just a little bit. So I'm actually going ahead and grabbing these really sick vintage jeans that I actually thrifted. They're Tommy Hilfiger, they're wide-legged at the bottom, making my legs look super long. And pairing so beautifully with that, I have this top from Urban Outfitters in the stunning rose color. I just really love this whole peasanty kind of trend with these puffy sleeves. It's so popular right now, and I think it's so feminine and girly too. And I'm just pairing my white sneakers to complete the whole look. These are my absolute favorite sneakers, and you guys will see them a ton in this video. And to jazz up all of these outfits, I'm wearing these stunning hoops that I recently got. They are so flattering and make every outfit look that much better. But overall, for a chill back t-shirt and jeans look, this is definitely one that I would love to style. So I'm actually gonna go ahead and show you guys how you can take the exact same top and just switch it up for a different, girlier look. And I'm starting off this outfit by wearing this bodycon midi dress. I love midi dress lengths like skirts and dresses. I think they're super flattering and they're going strong this season, especially for the fall time. And for this look, I'm pairing that exact same peasant top just in a different pattern. This one is cream and it has some like little flowers on it. So right on top of the dress, I'm layering the shirt. And then to edge up the look a little bit, I actually paired it with my docks. These are my babies. I wear them all the time and they actually have some yellow stitching on them, which match the flowers on the top perfectly. They are honestly the perfect shoes for back to school, especially going into the fall time. They're super duper comfortable and edge up any girly look you may have. All right, so uh, let's take a step back because I do know that it's still summer and these are actually IMG shorts that I got in Urban Outfitters. They have this cool cargo utility feel, which is super popular. To balance off the top, I'm pairing it with a long sleeve shirt. This is one that's actually thrifted. I love this neon green color at the front and just racing tees in general. I have a collection, they'll always be my favorite. So I'm just going ahead and tucking that in right into the shorts. And then because color coordinating just makes me so happy, I have these incredible Fila disruptors in this lime neon color. How beautiful are they? I'm just freaking obsessed. I love this overall look. It's really badass, but still super comfortable for heading off to school. And this neon green, I don't know, too much? Mm, I don't think so. So I'm starting off this next look with these Dickies carpenter pants from the site. Honestly, they are so freaking comfortable. As soon as I saw them, I was like, hey, I have to snatch those up. And you guys know that the Dickies logo is like prominently red. Going ahead with that tag, I actually paired it with this red halter top from the Urban Outfitter site. Halter tops make me so nostalgic from the 90s and I'm so glad that they're coming back right now. And because I wanted to accentuate my waist a little bit, I decided to add a belt. This champion one is really cool and it also has a little bit of that red detail to bring the whole look together. Being that the look is definitely more edgy, I decided to go ahead and pair it with my slip-on vans. These are also something I wore in high school all the time and I decided to get a new pair from the Urban Outfitter site. I'm just really living for the color and this whole look gives me definite senorita vibes. So I know that wearing dresses is definitely something that's a little bit more bold and not everybody has the confidence to do so because sometimes they may feel a little bit too fancy to wear it to your campus. Like in this case, I really love this burnt orange polka dot dress from Urban Outfitters, but it can definitely feel a little bit fancier to wear to campus. What I would actually do just to tone it down is just pair it with a simple button down shirt. I actually thrifted this one, which is 100% pure linen, which because the fabric overall really wrinkles easily, it definitely gives the whole look a more comfy, chilled out vibe. And to make it even more casual, just go ahead and pair it with your favorite sneakers i'm wearing my nike air force ones like i told you you guys will see these a ton love this look so much whether you're heading off to brunch or you just want to make a statement in the hall this one is definitely your go-to if I had a choice to dress head to toe in neutrals every single day, oh baby, I would take it. So that's exactly the next look I'm showing you. This full fit is from Urban Outfitters. Oh my God, guys, these pants, these paper bag pants are freaking amazing. They're so high-waisted and so flattering. And one of my favorite little crop tops from the Urban site is this really, really thin dainty strap one. They have it in a ton of colors and I chose this olive green to match the pants perfectly. Even though the top is really cropped because the pants are high-waisted, it kind of balances out the look really well. Since it's a very neutral look, I wanted to have a pop of a shoe, so I I went ahead and added my high top Dior sneakers. These are my go-tos whenever I want to add some pattern into my looks. Tied back my hair in a little sleek ponytail and with this look, you're a head to toe neutral queen. 
pants that tend to flare more at the bottom definitely give a longer silhouette to my legs which hey i could always use the illusion of longer legs i have those pants paired with this halter top this one in white i just thought that the flare pants with the halter top would just give me a really nostalgic overall feel for sneakers i have on these white reebok classics they are so vintage definitely more of an old school shoe but i love it for the style and obviously you can wear this look as is but being that we are heading into the fall time i think it's finally time to pull out those jackets and those coats so i found this incredible trench guys that i thrifted for like 11 bucks it's insane this neutral tan color is everything and i'm obsessed with how long the silhouette is it's so lightweight and really perfect for fall honestly all that's missing is a coffee in hand and i'm ready to stroll onto campus and you guys already know it's not a Haley's Corner styling video unless I include at least one outfit with some plaid pants. I have on these plaid pants that I thrifted last fall from the men's section, super baggy and high-waisted, just like I love. And I'm pretty sure Urban Outfitters has like an identical pair selling right now, so I'll link it below. With that, I decided to pair this little navy tank top. They make these seamless tank tops so perfectly. I got them in like four or five different colors. They are honestly the perfect basic to wear with everything, especially if you want to layer. And then obviously, just to add some more coverage going into the fall time, I paired my favorite little denim jacket. It has more of an oversized boyfriend fit, which is just how I like it. And seriously though, baggy plaid pants like this, they kind of dupe a sweatpants. So on days that you want to just be comfortable, a go-to outfit is one just like this. So when I saw the snakeskin dress on the Urban site, I was like, oh my god, I need to have this. So I picked it up and definitely trying it on. It's a little bit more scandalous than I thought. Actually something perfect for a night out, especially if you're planning on going to some fun college parties. But I love the texture so much and I still want to make it a little bit more wearable for the daytime. And so what I decided to do here is actually pair a button down shirt right on top. I got this amazing little silky one from Wilfred. It is super flattering and I just love this color paired with the snakeskin pattern. And this is exactly the reason I love pairing tops on top of dresses because now it actually just doubled as a skirt, a snakeskin skirt. I mean, super cute, definitely something I would buy on its own. So it's a fun little way to take a piece and wear it in two different ways. So being that this is college outfit ideas, I thought that I would actually show you a more nighttime look if you are to go out. So I actually have that exact same dress in this beautiful burgundy color. To make this dress a little bit more wearable for the fall time and not as open, I actually decided to pair it with this really cool mesh shirt right under from Urban Outfitters as well. I feel like everybody needs to own a little mesh long sleeve top like this. Whether you wear it under t-shirts or under dresses, it's just so versatile and there's so many different ways that you can use it to transform different looks. And here's a shocker, instead of wearing sneakers since we're gonna be heading out for this look i actually decided to pair these really really chunky platform sandals i love that these ones give me a little bit of height but they actually do edge up the style quite a bit because it's a cool chunky look who i am definitely going to be channeling my inner kim possible with this look i'm starting off with the big baggy cargos because you know kim did it right and i actually love that they're super high-waisted because i can pair it with this cool neon crop top and it doesn't feel too open i know guys i mean this neon color it just gives me life i love it so 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 much and to add a little bit of that green back into the outfit i'm actually pairing my adidas stan smith sneakers these are honestly such a perfect sneaker they're super comfortable and i love the little added green detail tied up my hair in a little ponytail and threw on my big oversized denim jacket again to give me more coverage but you could totally wear it without it too i just love the combination of the green with the denim in the jacket and it's seriously a badass look for just strutting the halls these little flower mini skirts are something I've been seeing a ton in stores recently. I think they're so adorable, especially heading into the fall time. And the way that I'm going about styling the skirt is just pairing one of the Urban Outfitter crop tops. I told you guys these tank tops are amazing. They're like a perfect basic layering piece, especially heading into the fall time where layers become your best friend. To make this look a bit more comfy, I threw on this big oversized cardigan from the Urban Outfitter site. Guys, it is the softest thing I've ever felt in my life. It also comes in like six, seven, eight different colors. I got it in gray and black. And the way that I like to make it more structured is actually to button down a couple buttons in the front and then tie off the bottom and it really helps in cinching in the waist so that you can see the skirt really well and then to top off this girly look i like to add some edginess and i'm styling my white combat boots with it my white and black docks are definitely going to be a staple for this upcoming fall season and i can't wait to wear them more and more so actually a top that is probably even softer than the cardigan right before is this one um i don't know if this is a pj shirt but let's be honest guys i sometimes wore pajamas to school i mean there's those days you know where you just you just can't and you got to make it look cute so in this case i have this like oversized long sleeve top and i have it paired here with some black levi's that i actually turned into shorts myself since the top part of the outfit is a little bit more simple i'm adding some textured shoes here at the bottom and truly guys on days especially where i have exams or i just can't sometimes i would just wear big baggy oversized shirts just like this but tucking them in and pairing them with some fun sneakers is just a nice way that you can kind of make it a little bit more like you tried seriously though the softness of this top if i wore this in class i could have probably fallen asleep in it what am i saying sometimes i actually did <laughs> 
So remember those tan paper bag pants that I showed you earlier? I was so obsessed with them that I actually got them in a white too. So here you go, I'm just gonna show you another little variation on how you can style it. Because I actually wanna style a fun accessory with this look, I'm gonna be pairing a simple black crop top. And for shoes, you guys know the whole chunky sneaker trend has been huge. And one of my favorite versions is these Nikes. They are the M2K Nikes. I got them in black. They are so freaking comfortable. And if you're into chunky shoes, you should definitely check out these. For the little accessory that I mentioned, I'm actually gonna be pairing this Gucci vintage bucket hat. How freaking cool is it? I'm obsessed with these neutral colors and overall just the fit of it is kind of perfect. I've been loving bucket hats recently and I actually wore hats a ton in college. Super simple and I actually styled these pants and this hat kind of differently on my Instagram so you guys could definitely go ahead and check out my Instagram page for my outfit photos. I tend to post a lot of my favorite outfits on there along with some of my things that I thrift so if you guys want to see me styling any of these pieces you can go ahead and follow me on Instagram for that. And that's it guys we've made it to the last outfit and for this one I gotta pull out those mom jeans because you know at the end of the day they definitely are a fave for me. So I have these vintage high-rise Levi's that honestly are my obsession. With those I actually paired this incredible halter top. It's the same one that you've seen before but in this amazing lavender color. This is another one of my favorite colors so I actually picked up these beautiful Fila disruptors in this lavender color too. They're just so perfect in so many ways. I love them so much. You can definitely wear it on its own but again to be more comfortable and more laid back I'm just adding on the same black cardigan that you guys saw before. It's just so comfy. I just had to end off the video with it once again. Adding a little color is always needed, especially when you're feeling so dull on those campus grounds. And I color like this lavender. It's so beautiful. I mean, I even got a little Polaroid camera from Urban Outfitters in the same color. I guess you can say I'm obsessed. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching. I really hope that you enjoyed these back to school, back to college outfits. If you did, be sure to give it a really big thumbs up. That honestly helps me out a lot. Comment down below which of these outfits was your favorite, which one you would definitely be styling for back to school. And I also made sure to link all of these pieces down below in the description box so you can go ahead and shop the Urban Outfitters site. The back to school Urban Outfitters collection has so many amazing clothes as well as a bunch of stuff you can use to decorate your dorm. I mean, look at these pillows that I got. I got like six of them because I was actually so obsessed with these colors. And this fluffy blanket too. All together, it's so aesthetically pleasing and a really great way to spruce up my space. Thank you so much again to Urban Outfitters for sponsoring this video. And for all of you watching, be sure to subscribe down below if you haven't already to join the amazing family. Love you all so much and I can't wait to see you in my next one. Bye!